It is time to take a look at what is trending today with Cowboy Dave from the Morning Bowl 100.3. How are you, dude? I'm good. How are you all? Good. How's, well. how's your rooster Jerry doing? Jerry's always good. He's, he's a little always. cocky, but he's good. You know? <laughs> oh, good answer. <laughs> so you've got all kinds of cool stuff trending on the internet for us. Did you guys hear about the dad? The da okay, we're all dads. We all want to be cool. None of us can dance. Not one of us. Except for this one guy, this one dad. They caught it on video. He goes to his high school reunion, hanging out with his buddies, decides He's gonna go. He's gonna go all 1985 thriller on these guys, and he just he just ripped it up. Look at him. He's amazing. I couldn't do that. I tried it when I saw it last night. I tried it. Sprained both my. Oh, wow. Look at that. Oh, break dance action. So it was, it was like a dad's dance off is what's going on. That's exactly right. Oh, wow. It looks like it's a bunch of them doing it actually. Wow. You know what I think? I think they were hanging out. They had the, they had the cardboard on the ground back in the 80s. Yep. They used to have the competitions on the street corners. What I think. Looks like a bunch of guys got into that. Well, I'm sure they all got together and told a bunch of dads jokes afterward, right? Uh, That's absolutely right. You know, I'm going to guess there might have been one or two beers involved in this one. 17, maybe 18. <laughs> yeah. That's proof. Guys, remember your kids have cameras all the time. <laughs> it's true. Watch what you do. It's true. All right, up next, remember the pants, the dirty pants, and then the clear pants? Yes, from, yes, from Nordstrom. Right. Okay, yeah. now there's something is equally ridiculous. I haven't tried them. I might. You never know. Uh, two pairs of jeans made into one dress. Have y'all seen this? Wait, oh, Cowboy look. Dave, you'd wear a dress. I don't believe it ever. <laughs> if, you, if you give me 10 bucks, I'll do it. Really? You know what? I actually Probably think that bucks. looks kind of cool. The other jeans that, like the clear window jeans, right. I thought those were an April okay, Fool's joke. Okay, but isn't it like, what is that, $445? Uh-uh. Not, yeah. not for 445 bucks. This I'll is... get D. Brown to DIY one. And... <laughs> right. You know what? Please. I bet you could go on Pinterest and find jean dress DIY and totally. make that same dress for 10 bucks. You know, what, you know what this is? This is Pinterest gone amok. Too many people have Pinterest pages. That's all this means. <laughs> but it's repurposing. People are making money. How could it be a bad thing? But all right, Cowboy Dave. No. no. Let's, let's get that. some cuteness in number three. All right, y'all. I've told y'all before. I've told all over the city of Houston the animals are going to take over. <laughs> they really are. We're going to have a Planet of the Apes situation here real soon if we're not careful. Seriously? Yeah. Did you guys see the panda bear, the, the panda video of the little panda escaping from his... No, but I love pandas. Right. <gasps> so oh, the panda's in the zoo, <laughs> figures it out. you got to think, this panda is not even a year old, right? And it's figuring out how to do stuff like that this. so cute. That's oh, What's goodness. it going to know how to do next? It's going to learn how to drive. It can get your Starbucks order. And <laughs> Look at him. He's like cruising legs. Like, okay, I'm out. Nobody saw me. <laughs> That's oh. adorable. So he's over 850,000 views right. on YouTube there. That's incredible. I need to have my animals do something cool like that. Yeah. Man, all right, let's go up next. Up next, we got to, okay, this creeps me out. I didn't want to talk about this, and y'all are going to make me. <laughs> Ventriloquists freak me out. I don't like them. Like, especially the little dummy. Oh, is it the puppets yeah. that you don't like? Well, no, I'm, I'm all right with puppets. I, I got puppets myself. That you was do? weird. That was <laughs> weird. Okay, I we wasn't won't to ask say that. about that. <laughs> I'll show you. That's a whole different Facebook page. I'll show you all later. But the ventriloquist dummies look like they remind me of Chucky from Child's Play. Yeah, they kind of oh. do. You know what like I mean? From a horror film. But this, okay, kid, but this one's kind of cool, though. Right. This is, this is what, a 12-year-old? Yeah, this 12-year-old was amazing. And I haven't seen it. What is it? The talent shined through while it's a little, little kid doing a puppet. Oh, that's a cute ventriloquist. Right. Look at her. That, this is the girl who got the golden buzzer. Right. She went oh. right through. She went right through. And she's amazing. Look. Not only does she have enough personality for herself, she's got that puppet taken care of, too. The puppet has more personality than her. That's the key to handling puppets. I'm saying way too much. I know. Why do I know so much I about know. puppets? I know. Why do you know so much about this? So Mel B gave her the golden buzzer right. and advanced her. It essentially guarantees her a spot in the live show. That's right. And it sounds like this has already had, what, like over 640,000 views and just you know, really cranking them up. That's awesome. That's incredible. Cool. Congratulations to her. All right. Now, let's talk about the paper toss. At the end of school, everybody likes to do something, right? Whether it's, I'm not going to say what we did. Okay, I'll, so we always just throw our paper out the window of the bus, right? You did? Well, we got your backpack and you toss it out driving down the road, and then the next day the cops come to your house and get you. Yeah, that didn't happen to y'all? No. Uh, no, I did not litter ever. I grew up in, in the city, life. Cowboy Day. Mag they Magnolia, didn't let us Magnolia PD, sorry guys. <laughs> So these guys are doing it uh, at, is this at Basha, Basha High School in Arizona. They're celebrating the end oh of the year. Oh, my God. Right, with that. Wow. How incredible is that? Doesn't To me, that just looks cool. Okay, but, but didn't they get, they had, like, school approvals to do right. this, and then the kids had to clean it up afterwards. Which takes all the cool away. If you have to ask your mom and dad to do it, it ain't cool anymore. No, it's oh still cool. Oh, my goodness. That's got to be such a good feeling of, like, a oh, stress man. reliever. 
For Unless a second, I thought we had confused the video with some recycling center. But <laughs> that is. Can you imagine being school. the janitor? Oh my goodness. That guy went home stressed with PTSD. Yeah, the kids is what he had got to clean now. it up. The kids, Man, had to yes, clean the kids up. cleaned it up. God All bless right. them. That's a good way to get rid of the end of the year. Yeah, Cowboy Dave, as always, great to see you. My hey, pleasure. Seth, you gotta bring Jerry back. We're, I'll we're, bring Jerry. We, we're missing him. Yeah, but put a diaper on him though, because we don't want our set <laughs> getting messed you up. You got it. Yeah. Hey, you can catch Cowboy Dave with jo with George and Mo weekday mornings on the Morning Bull at 100.3 The Bull. All right.